Howdy folks, Justin here. Today, by popular request, we are hopping onto the ladder with Cheated Hearts. That's, of course, Creatureless Battle Mage. Uh, Battle Mage has a lot of things going for it. You have access to Stormcloak Camp, which is a way to win, besides um, Mage's Guild Retreat. And you have access to Skeevers, another way to win without uh, playing Mage's Guild Retreat. And we're playing against Crusader. It's rock and roll. You don't have any life gain, which kind of sucks. Let's see what we can do. All right, they have the ring. This is not, not good. Uh, but we have Moment of Clarity, Skeever Infestation, Firebolt. That's probably the best start we could possibly hope for. We got four, three Firestorms, three Ice Storms. We're going to try to uh, get some work out of them. What's up, dude? Lock to your house. You just think that I'm a Prophecy Battle Mage and don't go face for a while. Wow, Scouting Patrol. Makes Skeever Infestation look pretty sad. Let's see here. Raiding party. All right, let's move to clarity for Lydia. Lydia's pretty good. Lydia can get silenced, so we need to place her someplace where she can trade effectively, even if she's been silenced. But, yeah, I'm, I'm down with Lydia. There's our Mage's Guild retreat. Thinking about Crusaders assaulting this. All right, what do we got? Nothing. Maybe that's good. Skeever infestation numero uno. All right. I mean, it's no scouting patrol. It's a, it's a skeever patrol. <laughs> All right. One of these seasons, I got to get all the way to legend playing creatureless decks. This is not that season. But since I started this quest at rank three, but in the serpent at rank three. <laughs> All right, what do we got? Next turn, we have access to Raiding Party and Firebolt. Wow, this is, this is going to be good, actually. So, uh, maybe I Moment of Clarity? A double Firebolt. You know what? I'm going to make most effective use of my magic. I'm going to do this. Okay. Now, they know that we have the Nord Firebrands. There's sort of a cost to what we just did. But I'm laying down Lydia next turn. Unless I can kill that. Yeah. We have three Fell the Mighties in the deck. Well. <laughs> oh, man. If we can just. Uh, we're going to get hit with Triumph at Jarl. Which is going to be a pain in the ass. Fifth Legion Trainer. Nord Firebrand. Okay. There's Stormcloak Camp. But I think this is this is a really good Lydia. Because we're getting close to playing Mage's Guild Retreat. In fact, we might play Mage's Guild Retreat next turn. I'm going to save the rapid shot cycling. If he can't answer Lydia... Cast out. Oh, dude, get wrecked. I got wrecked. That's pretty brutal. That is pretty brutal. Training is over. Another it's fifth time. legion trainer. So I can, I can do all the things I want to do next turn. I can rapid shot firebolt that play Lydia again. And I'm going to go ahead and take out this 2-1. So we need to look in, be on the lookout for cast outs. Something to keep in mind. I would really like to play Mage's Guild Retreat next turn. Cloudrest Illusionist. No way you have Execute, right? This is about as good a turn for Mage's Guild Retreat as I'm ever going to get. Did you hear that? Okay. Yeah, let's rock and roll. For White Run. Okay. Skeever Infestation, Moment of Clarity, Rapid Shot, the only supports, or I'm sorry, the only actions in our hand. 
I really need him not to have a steel scimitar here. Okay. All right. Now it's Jarl we're most concerned with. Oh, these Stormcoat camps are looking so bad. Oh, Ice Storm. Ice Storm would be the ultimate draw. Ash Berserker would be super, super bad for us. Alright, taking some damage. I can run a guy into that, so I'm going to do that. Reverberating Strike, more removal. There's the Ice Storm. But I can kill all that, right? Nord Firebrand into the 5 1. Yeah. Time to fight. I'm gonna save my Ice Storm. Moment of Clarity. I would love an Iron Atronach. <laughs> we have an ob we have an observer. All right. All right. A little distraction might prove. Collateral illusionist. We just need to keep the board empty until we play Iron Atronach. We know our opponent has charge creatures, which is super unfortunate. We're getting the worst Atronach too this time. The Nords must take back Skyrim. That's not good. Unless he puts it in field lane. Okay. Oh, that's terrible for us. We have nine. You can only do 13, so I need a Battle Mage's Onslaught. Red Year's not going to do it. Glass Greaves not going to do it. Phalanx Exemplar. All right, one of those cards. Don't be a, don't, no silence, no removal, no cast out. Ugh, it's brutal. Hopefully, actually, he doesn't swing into this to, to get more draws out of Ash Berserker, and we can leave a guard in each lane, and I can play Iron Nature Knock in the field lane. Come on, then. I'll leave yeah, there's a charge creature. Time to fight. Okay. Attack. Yeah, don't, don't kill my guy. Okay. All right. Now we have to ice storm. We can ice storm fabricate. Never get the best of us. We hit a prophecy. It's probably good. A creature we can ice storm away. A little distraction might Perfect. Be useful. And we get a guard to put up. We only can do six with that, so we need another guard off of this. A four drop. Sword is yours. 
Alright. There's our Atronach. Two. It's going to take a lot. It's going to take a lot to kill us. Well played. Well played. This was a worthy oh. I got some for this. The RNG sunglasses have returned. <laughs> and that is how you go from the serpent in rank three to rank two with creatureless battle mage. Whoa!